Hey dudes and dudettes, this is Paul Acevedo of Windows Central. Tonight we are going to play some Neverwinter. I am joined by my fellow guildmates. There's a bunch of them, so let's run down the list. We've got Icky, also known as Lyle. Hey. Then we have Andar, also known as Mike. Hey guys. Daryl, also known as Dazara. Hello. And his wife, Melissa. Hello. There she is. And finally, our good friend Perfect Zero, also known as Thomas. Greetings. Yo, and we are going to play the new Neverwinter Storm King's Thunder expansion on Xbox One. It is also available on PlayStation 4. I have a bunch of different characters. Normally you get two characters for free, but you can purchase additional character slots. I'm just going to go with my main dude. Who used to be a human, but he is now a half ogre. I changed his race because I thought it was going to increase his stats, and I can't actually detect any difference in his stats. So that's a little disappointing. He got uglier to no particular benefit. <laughs> you got something against orcs, man? <laughs> As a matter of fact. Okay. Do a quick invocation, and I'm going to check my professions real fast. Professions are a little thing you can do. You basically just, it's like crafting and stuff. You just start these little jobs, and they take hours, and you just, you know, let them go on. So guys, everybody tell us how long you've been playing Neverwinter. Take turns. Uh, probably about two years. Same here. Yeah, been wow. Two two years since it came out on the Xbox. Nice. And yeah, me, Daryl, Melissa have been playing basically from same time. <laughs> Ever existed <laughs> on Xbox. Just about, yeah. Yes. Yeah, there wasn't a Mass Effect for, uh, you know, Xbox One, so we had to find something to play, because we used to play it all the time. <laughs> you know, Dragon Age Inquisition's multiplayer is kind of like Mass Effect's multiplayer. Strongholds. Uh, piss, piss, piss uh, <laughs> Not as good, you say? No, 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 oh. no. Once they come out with Mass Effect 3 on here, we'll be happy. Yep, 84, I don't know if you still play, bro. In the audience, everybody's telling us how long they played. Dark Star started at the beginning, it sounds like, on and off. The Squire, one year. Right on. That's longer than me. Icky and I both started in January when we did our first Neverwinter stream. This is, I believe, our... Yeah, probably nine yeah, months. And this is like our fourth nine. one since then, right? Yeah. Fourth stream. Yeah. All right. I have just headed to our guild stronghold... If you are in the, if you're the member of a guild, any guild, you have a stronghold. It will look similar to this, but as you level up the stronghold, it gets bigger and looks cooler. Basically, more detail. You can see we've got a lot of members of the guild just hanging out here in the stronghold. So here are the people who are going to play with us, and a few extra people were kind enough to join us. So it is really good to see everybody here showing solidarity. Invite to group. By the way, I have a new companion. You can see he is a little reptile creature called a uh, Rimmer has. It's a premium thing, so I don't know if everybody needs to buy it or not, but I chose to buy it to support them. You're already in a group, Mapetite, so I can't invite you. Yeah, she's over here with Andor okay. and me. Oh, okay. There we go. I just <laughs> left the go. group. Yes. All right, um, so let's get invite to group, and that should be all five of us. There's Deadpool, who is watching the stream tonight. Good to see you in the game. A few other friends. So you can see we have this fancy fountain. This is a relatively new addition to the stronghold. We've had it for a little while. And we recently upgraded our marketplace so that people can buy more stuff here. Not as essential as it used to be, because in the previous update they added alliances, which are like alliances between guilds, as a matter of fact. So our guild is in an alliance with a bunch of other guilds. I guess we could glance at that real fast. We go to my guild. And let's go look at the alliance right over here. The Filthy Casuals Alliance. It was actually started by Ruthless, I believe. But you can see there's a bunch of different guilds yeah. here, and here is Neverwinter. I'm sorry, Windows Central, yeah. 
Yes, Major Garber asks if I'm riding a green owlbear. That is exactly right. That was one of our previous prizes that we gave away during a stream. Tonight, for Xbox One users, we're giving away the Trove of Elemental Evil, which is uh, an item that you can actually win just from lockboxes. That's what we received from Perfect Dark. I'm sorry, from Perfect World. And But for PlayStation users, they get to win the Howler Mount, which is a really cool prize, just like the Green Owl Bear here. You can only get it through contests. So, yeah, PlayStation oh, nice. viewers have it easy tonight. They've got it made. Absolutely. <laughs> nice so the howler is a nice mount yeah i wish i had one and they've you know <laughs> relatively recently they improved the mounts feature i guess we could glance at that before we head off just go over here to mounts and you may have several different mounts like one's faster than another but the cool thing is you can equip the appearance of any mount and then equip the speed and power of other mounts and just mix and match so that you can ride whichever mount you want to and I have a total of five here I might own another one that I don't have equipped or something but those are all my mounts in my stable all right guys let's head to protectors enclave if somebody could type out a thank you to the guild in the chat that would be appreciated view overworld map protectors enclave so our focus tonight is to show off the beginning of the new campaign storm king's thunder and to initiate that, we first have to get a quest in Protector's Enclave, which is the main hub of the game, the main city area. Ah, John, Jono likes how the mounts look. I agree with that. There's a lot of them. Many of them are really neat, and, you know, some of them are premium. And uh, I mean, even the premium stuff, technically, you can buy through the auction house. So some people who never spend any money but are able to save up a lot of in-game currency can get really cool mounts too. But you know, you can get some sweet. You can get some you can get some real cool ones uh, you know, the water horse from Summer Festival. You don't have to spend any astral diamonds. You just do it every day and you get the water uh, horse which is a pretty cool mount. So it's a good way to get some neat looking mounts that way as well. That is a very good point. Yeah, they they'll do special events in which you can earn really good prizes and a lot of the time you just need to to play the event every day or almost every day to get it didn't they recently give out some kind of prize at the reward claims agent promo For 10 what? towns treasure trove there it is oh yeah everybody yes. gets one of that's those actually three. really yeah. good blood yeah, did ruby you pick that up, Melissa? <laughs> a lot of stuff in oh there, nice actually. Yes. Wow, that is yeah. a lot of good stuff. One spur, colony. Yeah, so this time I picked it up on my main guy. There was a time that I accidentally picked up one of those things on an alt, and I still regret that to this day. <laughs> Welcome, Sergeant Torrente. Great to see you here all the way from Puerto Rico. Killer Claptrap asks how many codes we are giving. I think Icky shared that. Thank you very much, Icky. Little 101 asks if Neverwinter is cross-platform. Unfortunately, it's not. I mean, there are no cross-platform games between Xbox and PS4 because Sony so far hasn't allowed it. But I'm sure even if they did allow Let's it, they would. Wall. Perfect World would keep the, these versions separate so they can update them and fix bugs as needed. I think Defiance yeah. was originally had the intention Greetings. of being a cross-platform, but it just didn't play out. That is a shame. Epic artifact equipment. Yeah. Obtain um. epic artifact equipment by completing specific quests. Okay. Um, oops. Did, didn't that they announce a Windows 10 version? Um, of what? Never Winter? On the uh, marketplace? They, they did announce they it. That? I don't know what happened but to it. It hasn't appeared yet. Guys, Lord Never Ember isn't giving me the quest. What do I do? He gave it to my alt. Um, you oh. just got to talk to Sergeant Oh, that's Nox right. First. Yeah, my yeah, you, you, yeah, you have talked to Knox. Thank you for the yeah. reminder. And then he he sent you up there. That makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, I'm down here by Knox. Thanks for your right patience, now. everybody. A little sleepy. 
There we go. Here's the quest that you have to get to start the new campaign. And you have to be level 70 to start this new campaign, and you probably want to be really tough too, don't you? Um, nah, you know, to be to be honest with you, the enemies in the in the first couple areas that have I've unlocked are actually easier than Icewind Dale, considerably easier. So I think if you're 70 and you're mid 2000 item score you should be okay yeah if you look at the uh, order that they're in in the campaign it's actually below icewind dale and, and yeah there's icewind there. dale. so i think it's actually the first part of it's pretty easy i i went there and did it with my my cleric which is just turns seven issues right around 2000 so and she had no problems with it well, that's good to hear yeah but it's moscar moscar is build though and it's awesome <laughs> okay guys once the only oh, issue real quick once oh, you ahead. get the quest from First you go to Lord, I mean, to Sergeant Knox, then to Lord Never Ember. Yeah, yeah. Then you have to travel to Rothay Valley to a special instance part of it. So we are heading there now, everybody. Please join us over here. Right in front of Lord Never Ember. Yeah, that is true. There are so, There is one Xbox One game that is cross-platform with PC. It, well, one besides the Windows 10 titles. And that is Rocket League. Are we missing somebody? Come on, Des. Um, uh, me, I was down uh, by okay. the door. The actual I couldn't door. walk and talk at the same time. You know how it is. <laughs> Pat your head and rub your stomach. <laughs> exactly. All right. So now as we're gathered together and we're traveling to this special instance to begin the quest. Yeah, that's right, Excalibur. Microsoft would allow Xbox and PS4 cross-platform play officially, is what they recently said, I don't know, six months ago or however many months ago. But so far, Sony hasn't allowed it. Okay, now we're here at Rothy Valley, and it's nighttime. Usually when you go here, it's daytime. And I'm gonna talk to Zuna. Don't skip all the talking, guys. Let me do that. Anyway, she... Looks like we're up. I don't know, we're waiting for another guy. What's his name? I forget. Or we're supposed to meet him or something. But anyway, these people are being attacked through the mine here, so we're going to run through and fight some bad guys. Yep, stay away from that A button, guys. <laughs> yeah, just let me be in control of that, please. Everybody coming? Cool. Yeah, we're just whipping up on some bandits, looks like. Picking up some junk. I play as a trickster rogue, by the way. A thief. What class are you guys playing right now? Scourge Warlock. I'm a control Take wizard. Turn. Trickster Dude. rogue. And what'd you say, Thomas? Yeah. Oh, Scourge is nice. Well. You notice nobody said cleric, unfortunately. Not that we need one right this minute, but if you are interested in starting Neverwinter and you want to be a class that's in demand, please pick a cleric, because trust me, our guild is always in need of clerics, and it's probably like that for other guilds too, which is the healing class. The clerics are the new favorite class, actually. Okay. I mean, with their, with their buffs, it's ridiculous what they can do. That's good to hear. Alright. So we're supposed to be waiting for our friend to return, and it's showing the passage of time in the cinematic one day later. Four days later, we killed a dragon. I like that shot there. Seven days later. That's interesting. I'm not seeing any Seven of that. Days. I guess because I've done it already. Days. Yeah, same here. I'm yeah, I'm just seeing. I'm just seeing us. I'm just seeing us all standing wow. around. I'm surprised it doesn't play for everyone. <laughs> I, d I do like how she kicks the dragon in the head <laughs> yeah. while they're waiting. That's what you get, dragon. <laughs> By the way, guys, don't forget to read all of the articles that our bot is sharing in chat. Like we, It really helps us out for everybody to read our articles and leave comments on them. And remember, it's the best way you can show support for the stream besides being here. And it really separates the people who are just here from prizes from the people who actually want to pitch in and help out. So please read those articles. Speaking of which, tomorrow we have a big article coming up, and that's my WWE 2K17 review, 
which I was working on all week, and I, I'm very proud of it. It's a big, detailed review, and uh, even if you have not played the WWE games, you'll be able to understand. You know, I use language that makes it clear what the game's features and stuff are, and what it's like to start out as a new player. So I think everybody will enjoy reading that. So please be sure to read it tomorrow when it goes up live at windowscentral.com. All right, so where are we headed? Oh, there's a bunch of frozen ice people. Um, oh, over to the east. That's where. I think you guys have to get into the same oh, no. Does our, uh, um, instance first. Yeah, Dez and, and uh, Antar aren't here yet. Yeah, the map might be full because you guys joined the first Oh, that's instance. so lame. Okay, in that case, no, no, no we're, 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 we're no, actually, no, no, no. We, we, we may be, we, we may be getting there right now. There yeah, was no, no notification oh. to tell no us to uh, do yeah, anything. Yeah, that's bizarre. <laughs> we were just, we were just standing yeah. there. Looking Quests don't there. normally work that way. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like maybe they didn't, didn't, uh, haven't fully optimized this quest yet, or there's a, a bug in it that shouldn't be happening. Right now, no, it's sending. No, it's sending just because we've already back. done. But normally, clays, normally, so. if you're in a group and they're watching a cinematic, everybody sees it. Right. Yeah, it was really weird they didn't yeah. do it this time. Okay. Um, can you? Well, can we're you heading head over here? Protector's Enclave right now. Okay, but you need to head to Bryn wherever. Well, we're just all gonna have a nice sit down. Let's make a portal. Where are you <laughs> going, dude? <laughs> Uh, we'll get on with the quest while we I wait got for a you. Sign that would post. be better. Okay, I'm heading okay. there right so now. So anyway, here is yeah. somebody that we, our friend Zuna, who was just with us. It looks like things are a mess here. They didn't it's expect. We're going to Bryn Yeah, they Shandar. didn't expect it to be so cold. What's going on with this cold? Our two adventurer friends, running from a frost giant. Yeah, and these Whatever frozen people are someone we know. Apparently, I don't know them, but. If we weren't waiting for makeups. I overheard some <laughs> screams coming from the caravans nearby. Okay, and there's some nearby. The that's the rogue chick that did all the stuff in Mantle of Earth was. The one that Zuna, was, you mean? Yeah, you know that person. Yeah, I mean the the frozen people behind her. She just referred the okay, she referred to them are. as our two adventurer yeah, friends, which is very inspecific. I mean, unspecific. Anyway, there are some caravans around here that are not frozen, and we are going to go rescue them. So let's see. Look at the map. Oh wait, do I have to talk to someone else? Because it's showing. Oh, please don't tell me the quest is messing up. Everybody talk to her. That's what it is, maybe. I'm heading down. It spawned me well back into Bryn Shander. Uh, you guys should be down by the main the camp. The blue circle hasn't appeared for the quest, which is worrisome. But it does say save merchants hiding in caravans, so let's just run over there. I think it was to the east, wasn't it? I believe so. There's, there's a bunch of them in a big circle there. Here's a caravan. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So go up to the caravan, interact with it. Out come the people. It should be a bunch of wildlife that appears. Skeletonals thinking of Puff the Magic Dragon. Did anybody see that movie Pete's Dragon? I really wanted to see it, but I didn't have the chance. Yeah. The new one? No. I saw the I saw the original. I'm a little bit older. Yeah, no, I've got the original on Blu-ray. I really like it. But the new movie is supposed to be much different and much better. Yeah. Well, Shelley Winters and um Yeah, I mean, you can't beat that. <laughs> Great song Dark Star says. Dark Star is a oh, good what's song. that? Puff the Magic yeah. Dragon? <laughs> no hidden implications in that song oh, whatsoever, Lordy. either. Here's another merchant wagon. So once you coax the merchants out, bad guys spawn, and you just have to fight off the bad guys. Do that four times. And we will have completed the quest. Pick up some gold and drops. What's this? Can't even see what that is. Old knucklehead. Uh, that might be from yeah. a quest I had today. I, so. <laughs> yeah. I actually had Keep to leave what, uh, leave what I was doing to come over here. Oh, Darkstar, if you're playing on Xbox yeah. One, we would love to have you join our guild. 
you know, our guild in Neverwinter is it's called Windows Central, and you can just send me an in-game message. That would be Eastex at Eastex, or send me an Xbox Live message. Gamer tag is Eastex, and I will be happy to get you in. Okay, where's the next one? Did we already go to this one? Yeah. yeah. We are actually getting quite close to being full in our guild. Sweet. Doing great as far as getting Rad. members. Well, in I'm here. sure we have some dead weight we can drop. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> the only problem is figuring out who those people are. Hey, there's a wandering giant over here, Andor. Oh, let's go. Uh, yeah, yeah, those orange guys you see, by the way, folks. If you see uh, these guys walking around with an orange name, kill them because that's just a, a little quest you oh, can pick I up. Oh, I do that. And, and turn into the huntsman for free uh, Von and Blood. Okay. Let's all run over here and fight the giant. Yeah, we'll leave him alive for you. I already killed him earlier today, so I'm not going to get anything from him. But... And he won't attack you until you attack him. And he drops, I believe, a necklace or something like that. And, uh... Well, let's find out. There it is, right no, there. No, uh, yep, Actually, we waited... There it is, giant's necklace. We waited necklace. at least a month for you, up. Uh, have we actually kicked him out, Aki? Do you know? Yeah, I mean, I don't know, like, um, you're, you know, I you had me so. on, oh, well, he might still be in it, but I mean, you have me on Skype and everything, like, you're just, you know, if you're part of a guild, you have to he's, he's be, stay in touch a little bit, just uh, abandoning everybody. Who are, we who are we talking about? Value card. This yep. V, right? Yeah, V. Yeah, okay. V. Oh, yeah, v's you're still in, but yeah, long, you're, you're kind of testing yeah. the limits there as far as being able to stay in. We still need Rapture to show him the uh, <laughs> pencil disc. Yeah, we do know somebody who has a disc. <laughs> I, it, well, that tells you how long it's been since I recruited um, Jamie. Oh, man. Not yeah, seen that and pencil that was, disc, what, so august It's been quite some time. Yeah. <laughs> it's been yeah. a long time uh, since Jamie's I mean, been in the guild. Like, it's one thing to just not play for a while, but, I mean, you could at least talk to us through Skype and Xbox Live, etc. I did message him on Xbox Live. There's no reply. Oh, uh, that's cool, B. Yeah, and that's how it was with Skype. Like, he rarely replied. But, you know, we don't want to make you feel bad about not being friendly. Keep. Yeah. Love you, V. <laughs> you can be as unfriendly as you want. We still love you. There you go. There's some kind of point down here on the map. I want to see what. This we do miss you, Brian. Is. Come back, buddy. You could. <laughs> Relic boots off of the heroic encounter. Shawnee P asks if anybody. Oh, there it is. What is this thing over here? There's nothing here. Oh, his goal went off. He doesn't have his Xbox. Yeah, I mean. Goal. Yeah. You knew it, man. Uh, that's. I mean. I don't have anything I can say about that. Okay, come on, guys. Yeah, I'm starting the contest now. Yeah, sorry, I, I saw that little oh, icon yeah. on the map. I wanted to see what it was, but there's nothing there. How no, are you in not right, contest, not right now. There is a little heroic encounter off to our right oh, here, Paul. Oh, sure, let's Small do it one. then. See it over here? Let's see how uh, much time we have on it. It is... Um, it's almost seven minutes. It's okay. a pretty easy one. We just gotta kill some invading oh, sure. barbarians. Yeah, can't stand barbarians. Now these heroic encounters in here, they, they're not like Icewind Dale where they give a, a ton of stuff. I, I did a run the other day on some of the big ones. You do get a lot of Vaughn and Blood though, which is what you need to, um, first of all, upgrade the special armor you get on this DLC. And, um, and also you can purchase stuff with it. You can now purchase um, reinforcement stones for your uh, shirt and pants. Which you could never yeah. do before, so that's kind of cool. It gives you um, ever ever frost protection, additional six percent if you get both of them. Contest is open, guys. Speaking of the new armor that they've added with this expansion, Icky was telling me about it, and it sounds extremely lame. Hold off on it because I right away bought some with my trade bars and I have had no use for it yet whatsoever. It's in my bank right now. <laughs> and not only that, but there's a timer, so like it yeah. it runs out and stops being good unless you recharge it. 
Well, that's it. You have to use Vaughn and Blood to uh, get it to tier three. It, it it starts at tier one, then it'll actually go down to tier zero apparently, and it gives less protection at that point. Um, yeah. yeah. So yeah, I wasted um, a fair amount of trade bars on that. Shawnee Peak was saying that they really need to extend how long the timer goes because it just runs out too fast. And yeah, that's yeah. the thing. Uh. This new armor, which you know normally we would be trying to promote all the stuff they add and say it's great, but this new armor having to recharge it constantly and just grind to be able to keep your equipment good, that doesn't sound right. appealing in the least. Right. And it may it may be something you absolutely need as you unlock different areas. There are like four different areas that you have to unlock. Now we have to uh, burn these totems too, guys, during oh. this rogue counter. If you get a chance, yeah. run over and burn a totem. I just burned one, but... <clears throat> um... Oh, the yeah, it may, there may be a map where there's constant storm damage and you're taking Everfrost damage. And the Everfrost damage is brutal. It's worse than the regular damage you take from these guys. They'll hit you for 2,000 hit points and then do 8,000 Everfrost damage on top nice. of it. So um, they, well, it may actually come to a point where you need it. Most of the new map would actually have the uh, Everfrost damage. You will notice the damage deals to you. I've, un I've, I've unlocked the first two maps only because um, I missed the day when yeah. they were doing the maintenance. I had to work, so I had to sleep. Um, so far, I've unlocked yeah, this here. in Lonely Wood, and, and I have not seen any kind of damage unless my lifesteal has just been... Yeah, um, yeah because of lifesteal. Because regeneration doesn't work. Yeah, maybe I'm not noticing it. Ever frost. I don't have a lot of lifesteal. Yeah, so Is that... Oh, you know, something else you might want to point out with the new uh, expansion is... You can get rid of your uh, your greater healing potions, folks, because now they have the grand yeah. healing yeah. potions, which appear on every map, not just this map. But they appear in Sharendor yeah. and everywhere. It's I sold so mine immediately on the on the trade house, um, and it's twenty five thousand hit points instead of the ten thousand the other one was. So used much to give better. Me. So that's 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 um uh, yeah that's actually something good. So, Fair point, because that'll actually make the whole was, rest uh, of the game easier for a lot of people, won't it? Yes, it will. Twenty-five thousand's not. That's not to you know shake a stick at. That's it it nice. took him too long. Well, to the do last it. one was kind of a joke. Because yeah, healing potions were just not especially effective before. Once you got Useless. high level, yeah, and so finally they do a decent amount of healing. It's cool. Yeah, I mean twenty-five thousand. That's that's pretty good. Ten thousand. I mean they they sneeze on you and they do <laughs> ten thousand points of damage to you. So. Yeah, and it's not right. just like how much healing they do, but also the timer, the, you know, you can't use two in a row. You have to wait 15 seconds or 18 seconds, however many. Right. So that's why it's important that they do a decent amount of healing when you use one, because it's going to be a while before you can use the next one. But also, you don't only have to use healing potions. If you have a cleric or a well, paladin. stones of life. Or stones yeah. of life, yes which everyone should have all the time. Those are amazing. They are really nice. Uh, guys, I would like to just point out uh, for all the new viewer, please follow Windows Central. Yeah, don't. So that you can, so you can enter the contest? Yeah. Yeah. There we go. Great job, right. guys. OK, what do we get out of that? Claim reward. 30 Von and Blood and a rank 5 Azure. Yeah, well, I'll take it. Not bad. OK, let's go north from here. It's not. I, I, Again, it's not great, but the Vaughn and Blood, you want to build that up because that's how you progress in the campaign uh, as well. Vaughn and Blood is a silly word, isn't it's it? Hero it is. It's, it, it, it sounds Transylvanian <laughs> to me. <laughs> Count Blood, Vaughn and Blood, I don't know. <laughs> Lord Vaughn and Blood. this guy. Want to get back to ah, oh, you're an adventurer. So we've met before, apparently. Met before. I'm sorry. I'm not at my best right What's now. the dude from um, Never Death Graveyard that gives you the quest for your, like, I don't know, second bag oh, or something neat. like that? Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's that you dude. You gotta recover some Good merchant call. wares. Is it shareable? Let's find out. If, if you, um... Oh, it's not this guy. Never mind. It's in the uh, main uh, area. It takes too long to find the quest. No, it's not that dude, actually. That dude's up in the town. Uh, Never mind. I'm sorry. Spoilers! Dang it. <laughs> so, <laughs> recover merchant wares. Where do we go to do that? Um, 
there are little chests defended by bears and wolves and barbarians um, back out where we were, I guess. The, the, the only issue I had with this DLC is in this area in particular, your little uh, breadcrumb line there will tend to disappear on you. Mine, um, it's a little bit frustrating. Mine is just like showing the quest giver, just like when we first got into the area, it would only point to the quest giver. That's what it's doing again. So I have no idea which direction okay, to go. So one of you guys... One of the worst away. things about this map is the uh, breadcrumbs. Like, it's really hard to see them. So, like, if yes. you just, like, wander around and look at your mini-map, you might be able to see where you're supposed to go. Yeah, if you look at the mini-map, you should find... But you think it's south of where we yeah. were? Actually, I have the line on my map. Oh, cool. Excellent. I'm at, uh, above the uh, oh, building. That's where it is? Hill. North? Okay. All right, yep. let's go north, guys. Yep. Yeah, you'll see little ch uh, like treasure chests, and those are actually the merchant wares. They're Mine just didn't show up properly either, Paul. And I've never taken like right over here, right here. See me, guys, behind you. Okay. Well, there's one right over here behind me as well. There's a bear and some wolves. Yeah, that are I see it. One. Yeah, right behind you guys too. There's one. Interact. I'll go ahead and kill everything over here. Appreciate that. <laughs> ah, enemies. Nice to be part of a group. Now, can you share? Can you actually share these quests? Paul? Might well, make it I want easier. to, but it, finding the quest on the list because it doesn't just jump to it. Oh, well, you can do it through, through the there. this way, can I? No, just goes to quest journal. I feel that I must kill it. Oh. What's it called? Oh. Merchant was. This is another one of those. Yeah, um, sharing. I think most of the new quests you couldn't share. Probably not. <laughs> it's probably still a story quest. Here it is. Let's see options. Dragon share. Uh, oh, cannot giant. be shared. Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, uh, if you guys turn to your left, Paul, right over where I am, there should be some right Wait. here. There's a chest right here that Let I just... Let me help just... him with this frost giant real quick. Oh, yeah, you definitely want to kill those. Again, every time you kill one of those, they drop something. Um, there's, there's different guys with different names. There's a ghost in the actual town you go to, um, and they all drop little quests. That you can pick up and turn into the huntsman back at the main camp. And that's 50 Vonenblad each time you turn that in. Hey, Paul, there's one right up here where cool. I'm at. Oh, yeah. You yeah. didn't drop nothing, like a necklace or nothing. Uh, I see a necklace. Uh, maybe because we killed the other one. And they all said boo. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> all right. Got that chest. Thank you. Um, aren't they just kind of all over the place? They are. They're just you, every time you see a little group of enemies, chances are around here there's going to be a chest. You see them in a circle. I'm quite fond of chests. They're all actually. kind of just hovering around. <laughs> Who's not? Exactly. <laughs> hey, Paul. Depends which one right over to your uh, right? <laughs> following you. Uh, then all the cool people okay. are basically is. I think we can agree on that. Okay. Yeah, oh, yeah. Let's kill him. I got something to point him. out to you as I got something to point out to you as well right here when you get a chance. Right. These are these are scattered all over the area and you get a trawl when you go to the next area and you can dig these things yeah, up. Yeah, I want to dig and stuff. And this actually Yeah. You recover relics and each relic you oh. dig up, you turn in again for Vaughn. Oh, yep, we miss you, man. You should stick around or at least come by more often. Who's that? Yep, 84. <laughs> <sighs> uh, yeah, actually, as a matter of fact, next weekend probably we will be giving out a year of Xbox Live as one of the prizes. Is this glittering uh, for you right here, Paul? Hold on, let me yeah, see where you are. There you are. Next, come by where uh, I am. Just no, it's not glittering. Um, so where okay, is... well, if you watch, my character's going to get down. She's going to dig this up. Oh, yeah, I see that. And I just got an Astorian relic, which you can turn in to a guy. You now these trolls, they're not like the picks in Icewind Dale, where you get one and you always have it. You constantly have to every day get a new one because it only has two hours of play time, um, which is a, a little frustrating. But just remember to do it, and you can—they're scattered all over the place. These little uh, things you can dig up. But there is a premium one you can get too. Bonnet, isn't there? 
absolutely in the Zen market you can get yeah. a purple one, and it gives you. I assume, hopefully, that doesn't wear it's away. And you, yeah. you can get more Von and Blood, I believe, or more relics. More chest. For that. And and I cannot stress the Von and Blood is a big deal. It's the the most seems to be the most important uh, campaign currency in here so far. Oh, that you, you need, need one to more get. chest, yes. right? Here's. Right here, where I'm at. Uh, maybe. Is this one glowing? I... Yeah, right here where right here oh, where okay. Melissa is. Right. They Come should have one. Yep, yeah, there it is in the middle. Is this that? Oh yeah, you're right. Great. How did I miss that? Thank you very much to Icky for running the contest tonight. Icky is Thanks, Icky. Well, you know, Icky is second in command in the guild. He's a very, very helpful person, both in our regular weekend streams and in the guild itself. This guy needs help. Let's help him guard Cecil. He's in, he, he's incredibly handsome too. That's what all the ladies say. Uh, that's what they tell me. <laughs> Yeah, Iki, I understand you live somewhere very close to Australia, isn't that right? France. <laughs> Malaysia. <laughs> France is my doppelganger. <laughs> but we did him one better, recruited a guy who's Australian from Malaysia, hey. so we, you know, covered yeah. all the bases on that. They should be best friends. <laughs> Black that's Hammer. That's Mr. Black Dam. Black Probably Dagger, his yeah. cousin. Black Hammer. <laughs> Black Hammer, eh, you know, I just, yeah. I just recruit him. I can't remember for everyone's name. I try. Black Adder. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great, great show. Wow. I love Black Adder. The old BBC. Yeah, a long, long yeah. time. Okay, gu speak to guard Cecil at the Knucklehead Camp, which is where from here? Back where we first came South? in. South? Cool. Yeah. Now, if you uh, if that original giant dropped that necklace, you have to go into your uh, inventory oh. and click on that. It's like picking up the Hammerstone Queen yeah. quest. And uh, so go ahead and do that because you're going to turn it into the Huntsman Jarl, I think, at that camp okay. as well. He's off. He's off to the right hand I side. I accepted it. Yeah, he's over to the right here by the fire They've pit. You've got to fix this town up. It's not. Thank you for the help. This is just a camp. That's well, it's run down, man. Everybody's all frozen. Yeah, yeah but whoever's sculpting these ice statues is amazing. <laughs> She's got a point. <laughs> they do get bored here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, and over here is the guard. It is a bit morbid. I think we need to get him some jackets. <laughs> yeah, they probably could use some. You would think they'd put some tarps Maybe around a, the building. a nice hat something. like I've got. <laughs> there you go. All right, so it looks like we have to go northwest to help the guards fighting barbarians. Now, did you come over here to the Huntsman and turn your yes, little quest Yes, I did. Did you? All right, fantastic. Oh, yeah, I, I did mine. All the other there. guys. Okay, yeah, everyone do that because that's free stuff. Ah, crag cats. Yeah, any any time you see a guy with an orange name, and there are a handful of them wandering around this map, just kill them. <laughs> Avatar of don't ask questions. Avatar <laughs> of apathy says he wants something he can't really use. You know, you don't have to enter the contest if you don't want the prize. Yeah, just want. <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's probably people who <laughs> want the prize and try to enter. So just like enter when you when it's something you want. Yeah, well, you know, there is a chance in that thing to get the Wheel of Elements, and that, uh, if you don't even want that, that sells. Last time I sold mine, I think I sold it for, you know, 100,000 Astro Diamonds almost. Well, so. I imagine he might be a PC gamer No, it's around 200. It's 200 now, of course. Yeah, the Wheel of yeah. Elements is a really nice little relic to have. I love it. Well, I know you you, you yeah. actually use that, Paul. I see you when we do Dragon Flights, you throwing that thing up all I the time. I quite enjoy it. Ooh. Just so you can jump in the fire <laughs> element. Exactly. <laughs> but, hey. <laughs> hey there's, a, there's an orange guy over here. I know you're probably fighting dudes, but. Orange guy. I want to kill him. Where? I don't see an orange guy. He's called Harpsman the Turncoat? Oh, the Turncoat oh, okay. guy, yeah. yeah. Alright, let's go fight this turncoat. <laughs> okay. Everybody get a hit. Where's Daryl? Paul likes to kill the turncoat. Yeah. Ah, freaking <laughs> turncoats, man. <laughs> that is a cool I can't thing. even make fun of them because everybody says they have the gout. 
<laughs> little guild in oh. there. We actually heard I have from the, him. He's actually. I have that. I have that as oh, well. Oh yes. So. Yeah. What happened to awesome. him? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I feel a little better fun making fun of him if he's alive. <laughs> oh, so here's Shattered Guard Badge, so let's go and activate that in my inventory. Yep, run back to the Except camp quest to turn it in. Alright, um, we still have to fight one more guard that... fighting barbarians. Oh, oh, okay, yes, we're defending sir. the guards. I don't see one. Hey, Paul, oh, just a hit up. Quest. Yeah, vo your Vopal, 5.5 mil. Oh, so I should probably buy it, huh? Whoa. Someone sent it. Okay, yeah. real quick, we're going to look at the trade house. Give me a second, guys. <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to see how much <laughs> Astral Diamonds, I or how many Astral Diamonds I have right now? I found some guards over here. I'll kill these guys real quick. Yeah, Astral Diamonds are the currency used to buy things from the trade house, from the auction house, and, you know, if you sell things, then that's what you get. And I've been saving up a little bit. I've got 10 million right now. I beat you, Let's Andor. see. Browse. What's it under? Refinement? Did you? And then uh, I've, refinement. Yeah, and then what is it? Vorp, uh, transcendent Vorpal? Vorpal. Just, just like Vorpal. But then it'll show all of them, and I only want to see the transcendent. There's, there's only what? 60 listed. I need a greater so. one if you see how much that is. Uh, you know, why you're in there. <laughs> oh, I already searched for <laughs> transcendent, though. Buy oh, out. So okay, yeah, I just bought a transcendent Vorpal enchantment, which is gonna make my dude even more awesome. So that'll be nice. What do you got now? Uh, what do I have now, Aki? Regular? Oh, there's the new lockbox. Um, I think greater or regular. You have a I'm, greater. I'm not sure what you, you can have. sell it to me. I can't check it out. Well, we'll find out no. when I equip it. <laughs> so let's let's see. Complete the heroic encounter, Siege Sassy of Bryn games. Chander. It says. Whatever gets me that. That is right place. out, right out in front of the main gate of Bryn Chamber. You just fight off waves of barbarians. Oh well, good thing I don't like barbarians. There you go. Did you have a bad experience with a barbarian? Uh, who hasn't? <laughs> what happened, yeah. buddy? It's you can tell no, it. I used to play Civilization, <laughs> right? Oh, where the barbarians yeah. touched you. <laughs> Anybody who's played Civilization knows that barbarians are bad news. And you know, oh, Civ Six just came out on PC. Although I, I haven't gotten it, but... Okay, uh, they are sieging right now. Melissa and I are up here. Okay, let's go to where they are, which is to the north. Go see the sieging Oh, business. I got some polar bears. Yeah, you actually will run into trained polar bears in this DLC. You'll run into a, two frost giants walking around with a trained Dude. polar bear. Yeah, it's awesome. Thomas, how do you feel about polar bears? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's beautiful, the uh, barbarian, I mean, the uh, giant just like unfolds the newspaper and the polar bear goes right over to it. <laughs> awesome. Perhaps. Maybe not housebroken, but well, trained, yeah. nonetheless. Oh, okay. <laughs> you didn't say what you were doing. You're assuming it's a nice polar bear, then it probably <laughs> offers you a Coke. Oh! <laughs> Oh, look at that. Alright, Coke. Time to find you a local. <laughs> the squire says that barbarians and hill giants get a bad rap. Oh, so, yeah, it's fine, Avatar of Apathy. No worries. It takes giants. a little while to get used to how the stream works. Alright, uh, so we are going to defeat more enemies. Yeah, let's talk a little bit about the stream itself. You know, guys, we do this stream every Saturday of the year at the same time. 9 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Pacific. Uh, but it's not always Neverwinter. We play a lot of different things. Neverwinter is a game that we come back to every couple months for the stream. But yeah, every weekend is a different thing. Like, what did we stream last weekend, Icky? Anybody remember? Mafia yeah, 3. Ma Mafia 3. And before that, it was... Um, well, we did Forza Horizon 3, Gears of War 4. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, we stream a lot of different things. We're a variety stream. We like to show off all, all the different kinds of games you can find on Xbox One. My game froze. I hope it doesn't crash. And, there it is. and the Warhammer game? That oh be yeah, uh, well we did that midweek, but yeah, I'm talking about the official Saturday stream. How was uh, Gears, Gears of War, War 4? Gears of War 4 is great. I mean, 
funny thing is I've only done verses and horde mode so far, but I but they're both fantastic. I haven't even touched the campaign yet. I get a, a very sad impression from watching the trailer that Marcus dies in this one. Oh, it's, it's, it doesn't make it doesn't make me happy. Well, nobody talk about whether he dies <laughs> or not just... in the in the chat because yeah, Andar and I haven't played <laughs> through the campaign, so we don't want it. Well, I don't yeah. know if he does. I'm going based. I mean, somebody on the, in the uh, campaign. The I mean, I've seen in chat, they might be like, "Yeah, he does. That sucks." You know, oh, and we don't want to hear I that. Gotcha. Let's leave it to our imaginations. It doesn't look good when he's getting choked in the in the uh, trailer and his kids sitting there watching. Going, no. <laughs> that's not that's not encouraging. <laughs> I will say this: he does end up meeting a, a bat really bad. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Things get hairy. I'm thinking the enemy guts. But I, I hear that the end of the that the campaign just gets better and better as you go along is what several people have said. Like, it has a really exciting conclusion, doesn't it? Did you finish it, Thomas? That's good. Uh, I haven't finished it, but I can definitely say it gets better as nice. you go along. Because the opening's really <laughs> dry. Well, at least it warms up. You know, a lot of games, they kind of show you their best stuff at the beginning, and then it gets worse as you go along, because they're trying to hook you from the beginning, and then it, you know, kind of peters off a little or, bit. Or they're, they're out of budget. Yeah, or running out of money. So they have to start cutting ideas or <laughs> segments. That's never any good. I actually made it through the tutorial on Mordheim. Oh. Um, and started playing that a little bit. It's it's hardcore. It's pretty Very fun. Very hardcore. Now. If you like that. It, it's one of those, like, if you like that sort of thing, you'll like it. If, if you're not into it, you'll probably yeah, I feel, <laughs> like it. Yeah, I feel bad. I gave, I gave both hardcore. you and Thomas a copy of that. So if you guys ever wanted to play against each other, you could. And Icky has it as well. We're talking about Mordheim, which is a Warhammer game that just came out on Xbox One and PS4. It's already on PC. And, uh, yeah, like, I knew you like Warhammer, so I thought you might enjoy it. But then I didn't really understand how hardcore that game is. It is very, very hard and not well explained and just... It's a tough, unforgiving game. Oh, you, you'll figure it out, though. I mean... Yeah, if you, if you put the time into it. And I did, and I really like it. Icky just complains the whole time anytime he plays it. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. What's well, the stance? I How do you change play, the stance? Uh, the one thing I don't like about it is like you can't adjust the screen and like some of the information is off the edges oh, of the screen. Oh, that's a bummer. It annoys me. Yeah. <laughs> I just wish there were difficulty settings because like by default it is one of the hardest games you'll find anywhere and it would be nice to be able to make it a little more forgiving and manageable. Dark Souls. Uh, it's Dark harder Souls. than that. <laughs> I mean, in this... Oh, harder, harder than Dark Souls? Souls? Yeah, no, I mean, trust I me, it that. is. Played a little and you'll see. I was in <laughs> I was in this story mission. There's, like, each campaign has a bunch of, like, non-story missions and then, like, two story missions that you, you know, have to go through. The first one, I'm, like, I take my group into it. And by the way, there's permadeath and stuff like that. So I took my group into it and we... I just cast a buff spell, like a spell to buff my team. It had a critical failure and it killed her, my main leader guy. Like, and <laughs> so then, like, we were forced to lose the mission. Like, we had no hope after that. And then, as we, everyone gets these permanent injuries, so two characters lost an eye, one character lost a leg, and this renders them not very useful for the rest of the game. So, like, Oh my god, it's it's just mean. Like I never played a game that was so mean to the player, and yet it's still fun and interesting. But I mean, but you have to have the right temperament for it. Okay. So... <laughs> oh, that's a funny joke there, but I'll let it go. <laughs> okay, and back to what we're doing. <laughs> Balls. Uh, huh. Now the <clears throat> that's what we're talking to. The unfortunate part about this uh, this first area, you don't get too many missions the first day. When you come back the second and third day, you open up Lonely Wood, you start getting a lot more stuff to do. Uh, this one, they, they don't give you a whole lot to do the first time yeah, you come I'm in here. Yeah, turn in Quest Shattered Guard badges, all I have left, because I don't think there's anyone else who will give us quests here yet. So let's go south to turn that in at least, I guess. But it's a, a nice little town, except for being all overrun by frost and ice. Look at that. Yeah. There should be some questions. Uh, no, we here. were not. Um, we weren't talking one... about Vermintide. We were talking about Mordheim. To be clear, Mordheim oh, is not. Un okay. I'm sorry, Vermintide is not unfairly difficult. I really like Vermintide, and I think anybody who likes Left 4 Dead should buy it right away and play it with me. 
So just remember that if you like Left 4 Dead, definitely do buy Vermintide and read my review, which Moobot is sharing the link for. Uh, but no, the, the unforgiving Warhammer strategy game we were talking about is called Mordheim City of the Damned. Oh, here's Harshton the turncoat again. Anybody else want to beat him up? I'm not going back. Uh, you only need to beat him once, you don't have to do it twice. But I want to. <laughs> I hate turncoats. You guys know he that. He doesn't <laughs> drop anything. Uh, I'll tell you what he's going <laughs> to drop. His... I don't know. He's going to drop to the ground. How about that? His joy of <laughs> <Yeah>. living? <laughs> <laughs> his oxygen, his breathing capacity. <laughs> there we go, that takes care of him. He did drop the thing again. No, just a grand healing potion. Okay, back to... Looks like you're hitting harder. You think so? Hard oh, I haven't equipped now. it yet. No? Really? Summon a bank and grab that, dude. Yeah, I'll do it when we get to this little <laughs> town over here. Yeah, you just it's bought It's awesome it. to play with. I'm and, and I'll hold on to your radio <laughs> you know, Well, we'll see. And, uh, yeah, it'll all be good. <laughs> Let's go turn in the quest. You guys in the audience, does we know who plays Neverwinter because everybody spoke up about it, but does anyone play any other MMOs in the audience? Shattered Guard Badge complete. What's this? Got my Vaughn and Blood. Okay, going over here to the front. I'm going to summon a mailbox, which is something you can do if you're a VIP member of level 4 or higher, right? No, or... I forget, no, higher than level 4, isn't it? Won the auction. Okay, and um, let's see, what am I equipping this on? Here's my character. Right now my item level is 3278. Is it on my main hand or my off hand? Yeah, it's main hand. Main hand. Yeah, Mailbox is. is rank 6. Rank 6, thank you. Remove enchantment intact. Cost three gold, yes. Alright. Transcendent Vorpal enchantment. What's this offense slot? I also have an offense slot and I don't have a gem in there. I guess I should put one in just for now, huh? Do I have anything good? You were waiting for a rank yeah, 12? Yeah, you know what? I can wait a little bit longer. But I do have a rank 7 yeah, if I want. Yeah, the rank 8. But no, I'm just going to wait. Okay, so my item level just went up to 3321. So it went up by like 50. That's really nice. All I can say is booyah. Oh. Yeah. Alright, and. Uh, it means you have a regular. Yeah, it, it's only a regular, Daryl. <laughs> Sorry about getting Ooh. your hopes up. Oh, I, I was just picking on you anyway. But yeah, I would have been happy to share it with you if. I'd had it. Thanks. <laughs> what one of the uh, small winner? <laughs> one of our winner? Well, I, I'd uh, rather C5. give my diamonds to you than a stranger. Oh, he's he just got an emblem of the cult. <laughs> Isn't that the worst thing you can get? Oh, that's <laughs> yeah. the toy. That is yeah, the toy. Sorry about that, guys. Remember, we we just asked them for a prize, and that's what they gave us: is the trove of elemental evil. And you might get something good out of it, or you might get something not as good. Yeah. So you get some great or the worst possible yeah. pick. So what have we got left? We've got barbarian champ, barbarian champions, and barbarian worship that we can do. Is there anything else we can do? Oh, speak to the town residents. Uh, I'm sorry, I, I was. Yes, yeah, yeah. There are Man. quests back here. I'm, I'm waiting back I here. I didn't in see the, that quest. Uh, Dang in it. for you I guys. Have run off. Oh well. Yep. Okay, let's head back there. Yeah, there's about there's about three things you have to do in here before you go to the epicenter and the storm okay. starts. Dark Star plays the division. Uh, I do not. Division is not really an MMO. It's more of a, I don't know. It's more like Borderlands. I mean, you wouldn't call Borderlands an MMO. I'd I'd, I'd follow with um, Destiny, kind of like with me. Yeah, it's more like Destiny, which is like a semi MMO, kind of like Fantasy Star. Also, actually, Fantasy Star Online. But not quite what we usually consider an MMO, but it does have some of the same elements. Alright, let's talk to all these townspeople since I have to do that for a quest. Ah, get off of the lady. I've never met any guard braver than those stationed in Virginia. Yeah, thanks for your input, lady. Um, one to the right and then two to the left. Got it. They could at least get rid of all these frozen giant guys. 
It's kind of like, that reminds me of The Division, you know, in The Division, it takes place in a very realistic looking New York, but there's been a, an outbreak of a deadly disease, and all, they just leave all this trash and stuff laying around everywhere. It's like, come on guys, you can still pick up the trash. So, maybe, maybe that's what New York's really like, I've never been there. Oh no, the game just crashed on me. Yes. Yes. <laughs> well, that's Darn not good. It. Yeah, I'll be right back. <laughs> These things happen. Ah, Dark Star plays or has played Elder Scrolls Online. Oh, Link is going to create a cleric. Awesome, Link. Well, that's great. Link says that he doesn't usually play MMOs, but he really likes what he sees of this. That's cool. Yeah, I wasn't even planning to get into Neverwinter, but we wanted to do a stream for it, just because, you know, we like to show off different games on our stream. And, it, yeah, it just happened that me and Icky really got hooked, and then we formed a guild, and that's how we met these other fine people on mic with us tonight. Ain't that right, fellas? And lady? Absolutely. Yes. Yep. Hey, seen Olgaris just bought yes all for eight bucks. Where do you yeah. buy from? Yeah, where'd you get it for eight bucks? Where'd you get Elder Scrolls bucks? Online, which, by the way, is yeah. also really great if you like MMOs. Like in the mainstream gaming circles, a lot of people were very fussy about Elder Scrolls Online because it wasn't the single player game they wanted. But I mean, it is an Elder Scrolls MMO. I mean, it is perfectly good. It's really quite a lot like playing Oblivion, but multiplayer. It wouldn't install correctly on my Xbox. I have a copy oh, of it, but... Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I don't need to get sucked into another MMO. <laughs> this is, this That's is plenty. That's the thing. I, I still want to play more Star Trek Online. Like, uh, I'm quite impressed by it, but don't really have a whole lot of free time for that. So I'm trying to this map is confusing. Where's this fang storm? Who? What? Cute. Uh, Cue the fang storm. A, a wolf called fang storm. Now he's dead. <laughs> he'll drop. He'll drop some fur that you can pick up and turn into the huntsman. I don't think I get enough hits on him. Okay, I'm trying to go west to talk to these last two people on the map. Go oh, west, young man. Paul, you are in another instance, no, uh, <laughs> but it doesn't God. matter. Yeah. It doesn't yeah, matter. Well, is there any way to switch instances in this one? Yes, the okay, usual way. Same way, yeah. Because Icewind Dale doesn't let you, right? Uh, yeah. There's no uh, PvP in this area right now, so that's the only reason it doesn't Icewind Dale, I think. You always should, like, it should never split people up when you're in a group across different instances. That's just not cool. That actually happened to us the very first time we ever streamed this game and started playing. We got split up across, you know, and that was before we knew how to change instances and everything, so it took a little while. Okay, one last person to talk to, I think. All right, good. Spoke to all the residents. Now I will join you guys in your instance, hopefully, if it will let me. It won't let me select the team because that NPC is talking. Shut up. All right, move to their map instance. Yes. I'm running the contest now, if you guys want to join. Thanks, Lyle, you are the man. Yes, people can die in Neverwinter, of course. I'm not going to die unless we get somewhere hard, so we'll see how that goes. Yeah, I've been playing Neverwinter for a long time. That's what kids are for. <laughs> That's true. Now, I've been playing since January, which is quite a while, and I've played a lot, and I've, you know, spent money to get some, you know, on some nice little items here and there. So, yeah, I'm actually pretty buff and tough in this game. I mean, does Lyle, the Zara, and... And are all stronger than me, but I mean, because they're at the top of the, you know, they're very strong. But I'm still tougher than a lot of players, higher level, I should say. Whatever. Liberate Bryn Shandar. It says. 
What does that mean, guys? Uh, we should have to go around. Oh gosh, it's a couple days now. I'm trying to try remember. To look it up. Right here, there's the uh, take shelter. Just wanted to do that. Yeah, you just got to go into the inn. Uh, just yeah, you behind go. You. you go into the uh, epicenter right up here. Where? Okay, where are you guys? Who's who am I following? Okay. Uh, go to got where it. zero is. All right. <sighs> Let's go in. Sounds good. Nacho Coochie is asking what my item level is. We'll look. That's a fun username, Nacho Coochie. It's uh, a little naughty. <laughs> <laughs> too much. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, but I think it means like not your. Uh, okay, real fast, we're gonna glance at my character, which is a trickster rogue. He is item level three thousand three hundred twenty-one. So that took months of work. Playing, completing campaigns, playing the auction house, just doing all kinds of crap. Is Makos a famous D and D character? We didn't get to see what he, I'm we didn't not get to see sure. what he said because somebody else talked to him. Don't forget guys, we want to show off the stuff. It says we can return to Bryn Shandar, is that what we want to do? Is there anything else to do in here? Now this is when I bought the armor because it says, uh, you know, go head out into the storm. I go, oh geez, I better buy some armor. But um... Is this yeah, not when we're supposed to head out to the there's storm? There's a portal and... I guess that's just all we're supposed to do. Return to Duvesa Shane. To the ah, Tower Nacho okay. Coochie is it? Oh, she gives level twenty six hundred. Yeah, she gives you. She gives you another quest, I think, to go back in and weather How the storm. How nice! We'll get it. But uh, that's good, considering the PS4 Neverwinter's only been out for like three months, and he's already item level twenty six hundred. That's very good progress. Yep. That is very good progress. Better than some people. Perfect zero. Well, they did take they did take the grind <laughs> out of this game, so yeah, they they have eased up some of the higher end things yeah, to make yeah. them go faster, because they want people to get to level seventy, so they can do all the new campaigns yeah. they add. Um, yeah, yeah, but when you started from the beginning and you grinded like mm. really <laughs> hard, you get to like level sixty, and then like you know that's. Then you see a guy that's been on for two weeks and he's level 70, and you're like, really? <laughs> the Gathering <laughs> star is I mean, uh, just harsh. But that is encouraging for new people. You can level up very fast in this game now, whereas that wasn't always an option back in the day, so. Yeah, and now you can just buy level 70. Yeah, yeah, that's a new thing, too. That's, that's so outstanding. I've got two quests, guys. Liberate Bryn Shander and seek shelter. Go to Bryn Shander Epicenter. Which is where we just were. Yeah, so that's kind of lame that it... So you can go back... You know, you go back in there and oh, it's okay. a new quest. Well, so it probably will go make back everybody in that door come again. Along. Come back with me, won't you guys? He grinds to win. Uh, I the wrong door. Go to the Huntsman. Halfway there. Yeah, I mean, you can... Like, like everybody was just saying, you can buy a level 70 character now, which is... Again, it's just a way... Say you just started playing and you really want to play with your other level 70 friends. It's just a way to skip forward, to fast forward a little bit to be able to do that. But it costs money, so most I'm people not. won't do it. Somebody come back up here, please. I'm not sure. Top right at. corner of the city. The I door think you're we in a just. Different instance, oh, dang, you are. How did that happen? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh. If for some reason it put you in different right, instance I'll, when I'll you I'll left. leave the party and then I'll get back in later. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, not your fault. Oops. Um. Dang it, it's still not putting us in. We're waiting for zero. I blame society. You let me down, zero. <laughs> you guys are in eight, is that right? Uh, couldn't tell you. Um, we are in... Yes, eight. Yeah, eight is full, I can't get into it. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, Zenzo there. points out that if you do buy a level 70 character, I mean, you get some nice bags, you know, it's an amount. It's not a bad monetary value, sort of, but it doesn't give you all the highest quality stuff or anything. Zenzo has a an item level 3200 Paladin tank and a 3600 plus CW, Control Wizard. Very impressive. Control Wizard. 
Adventurer. Oh, yeah, cutscene. Yeah, Look at nice. That. So, somebody's making some noise here. Um, we have, I mean, Neverwinter gets these expansions every two or three months, guys, and it, it is a free-to-play game. A lot of people really do just never spend any money, although I, you know, like, buying a little bit of stuff will make your experience more pleasant and your progress a little faster. But... It you know you could just play for free and they release these expansions and you don't have you know say you bought some stuff early on you never have to buy anything again if you don't want to but you it's really nice how they keep adding to the game and making it better. Paul, you may have to invite Daryl back oh, to the group yeah. so he can get. Let's go back. Instance. We'll go back outside and then I'll invite him. Now this is where we were heading into the storm, and this is what made me think, oh geez, the storm, that must be Everfrost damage, I should buy my uh, armor right now. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> do not do that. You don't need it. The storm out here does absolutely nothing to you. Invite Daryl back in, invite the group. Well, actually, actually it does hurt a little. There you go. <laughs> really? Because like I'm not, edges... well, I'm not taking have... any damage whatsoever right now. You may have creepy, uh, creepy... Regeneration or something or something. What? I don't know. Could be. But like, you'll see the edges of the screen will get kind of red and like blue things will appear and uh, more damage. Really? I have never yeah. seen that in here. Only when an enemy hits you, you will see a snow icon or something like that. Well, that's the Everfrost damage that the enemies yeah. do when they hit you, but I haven't yeah. seen the uh, thing Daryl's talking about. It only damage you when you are being hit. Ah, I see. It's not a constant damage thing. And it reduces your defense Ow. as well as regeneration now, as long as you're in the map. By the way, Icky, we want to start the final con. That was only the second contest, right? Okay, we want to yes, start the final yes. one at 35 um, minutes after the hour. Yeah, cool. I know. Because it, it, we, it takes me around be... 10 minutes. We may be setting out all these Yeah, you're doing great. I mean, I, like, we're normally we space them out a little more evenly, but that's our hard stop where we need to get the contest done because we just have to. I got to work tonight, so. And we may actually be done with this before 35 minutes. Oh, that would be. <laughs> oh yeah, I am gonna. I'm gonna cap off the stream by opening some lock boxes because I know people like to watch people open lock boxes. So. Oh, yeah. I like that. Oh, hey, Icky, I sold that for uh, 1.5. 1.5 mil? Yeah, yeah that's I got good. One. It sold in just like a day. I was crazy. My main weapon is really cool looking now that it has that transcendent vorpal. It's now glowing blue. It didn't do that before, I don't think. Yeah. Um, oh, it should have. Maybe yeah, it, maybe it glowed it just, just wasn't silvery. As, wasn't it might have been as silvery. It, yeah. yeah. It's nice to be more powerful. Like mine glows. Mine glows red with the. Uh, if you, as you can see, mine is a red. I steal. Mixed with my black armor from the oh, yeah, blood theft. Sweet. Or, or not uh, blood theft. Uh, life drinker. Life drinker. Same difference. Yeah. I think it, I think it just looks very <laughs> cool. <laughs> so don't forget, guys. Please. Join us again next weekend. Join us every Saturday that you can. We are always giving out cool Xbox and PlayStation 4 prizes. Sometimes we only have Xbox prizes on a particular week, but we do like to do PlayStation prizes too. So just, like, you know, join us, become a part of our community, and you'll you'll get a lot out of it. Like, you'll learn a lot of, about games that you wouldn't have heard of before. You'll see some big games that you have heard of, and you can just, you know, see what I think of them, how I do at it, etc. And we try to have, we have different co-hosts every weekend as well, so we have, you know, we treat it like a live podcast, so a lot of times we have really fun discussions and stuff. Tonight we're a little more focused on the game and, and multiplayer since that's what we're doing, but when we do like a single player stream, you know, we just talk about all kinds of different things. And don't forget to visit windowscentral.com and leave a positive comment on tonight's article, and preferably on our other articles as well, such as our Vermintide review. We really appreciate those comments. They are important. So, you know, just be cool, leave a comment, and we'll all be so happy. You'll be happy and we'll be happy. It's a mutually beneficial relationship. All right, let's move along. I don't, hey, um, Sean, Shawnee Peak, I guess. Yeah, 
all the offices are online and I don't think that's really been going down, brother. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what that's even about. <laughs> Does he mean Windows Central question? leaders have been asking? That can't be. <laughs> yeah, that's like, mo uh, there's only one officer oh. not here right now. He so, might be speaking know. to somebody else in a different <laughs> guild. I think that's what it is. Because not there's other Neverwinter people and he's talking to someone else. Oh, we're fighting a Yeti boss. Sweet. I'll use my Wheel of Elements here. This is one of the things that you can get out of that trove. The It didn't display right. Way to go, Perfect World. But that's okay. <laughs> and now the hey, female hey. Yeti. Oh, no. No. Wolfgar. Wolfgar. Isn't he a famous D&D character? Well-known character from the Forgotten Sweet. Realms books. Yeah. Well, that is quite cool to see. And you see Caddy Bree in here as well. Yeah. She was, she was always fun. You know, speaking of Dungeons & Dragons lore, there are some D&D comics that I hear are pretty good. Like, there's a popular D&D character, we talked about this in the guild meeting one time, but popular D&D character named Drizzt Dorden. And uh, anyway, like, his the books that introduced him have been adapted into comics, and I, I bought them all on Comixology recently, and I'm really looking forward to reading them. And I think they also have an ongoing series about Minsk and his chipmunk, another popular character who shows up in the game. Space Hamster. Space Hamster, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for the correction. Yeah, thank you, Shawnee Peak. Yeah, he specified they were talking about PS4 stuff. Yeah, I, I told some PlayStation people about the stream at, at NeoGAF. And so I think some of them may have joined us tonight. Is anybody from NeoGAF in the audience? If so, be sure to say hi. NeoGAF is the internet's most popular gaming message board. A little hard to get an account created there. You have to have a specific kind of email address or they won't let you join. But it's a really good community to be a part of. And they break a lot of news stories. Like a lot of people leak information and, and stuff like that there. So they are often a source for stories on Kotaku and other sites. Wolfgar in Bigrin's Tomb. Oh nice, the Squire is giving us a little D&D history there about Wolfgar and other characters. Let's go down these stairs. This is a really cool campaign so far. I understand it gets really hard eventually, but for now... I'll let, I'll let you examine oh, this, you. Paul. Dude, it's a, a frozen cool Oculus, cold isn't cut it? Scene for you. Hey, yeah, That's what it looks I mean, like. it's the same character model, I think. A strange cocoon frozen over in ice. It seems to be made of a different substance. Could this be the source of the blizzard? Take a closer look. And are the frost giants after it? Wolfgar's helping me look at it. Can't find anything to prove that it's generating the blizzard. Maybe it's what's inside the cocoon. Let's go back and talk to Devessa Shane, why not? Awesome, Shawnee Peak is from Gaff. Excellent. Yeah, I really appreciate you guys coming along. Alright, let's go back to the town square. Yeah, that is true, Angel Kiss. Is the mount that we are giving out is only for PlayStation 4, unfortunately. We've given out Xbox mounts before this time we weren't able to negotiate a better price for Xbox users, unfortunately. But, hey. Ooh, I just got a close-up look at your character. He is much uglier. <laughs> yeah, ugly. it's a shame. <laughs> it's quite a shame. From a distance, he's okay, but once you look at his face, oh, God. You gotta put a bag over his head, if you know what I'm saying. Right. Looks like your old character just... Something went real wrong with him. Yeah, this is my old character with, like, a birth defect of some Same sort. Same clothes. <laughs> just... <laughs> hey, maybe I need some new threads now that you mention it. Defending the Dale is a repeating oh, quest, dude. complete quest given by everybody else. We've got the expedition. Speak to Christopher Chettlebell. What a nice name. Did we not invite Daryl? I invited He's him. The guy. So. He's the guy from uh, Never, Never Death. Ah. Are you going to come back, Daryl? Because we really miss you. You never, I never got an invite. You're not the leader. Oh, that's the problem. Oh, Zero's the leader. I see. Zero, can you invite Dazara no. back, please? Pushy, mister. He should be able to get to our instance if he's in our group. Oh, yeah, by the way, I want to 
congratulate <laughs> our longtime cool. viewer who has often been a co-host on the stream, and that's Royal Bob. I don't know if he is watching the stream tonight, but Royal Bob just got married, and he's having like a bigger ceremony next weekend, so he's not going to be able to watch next weekend's stream. But yeah, yeah, very happy for him. He actually got married to a. Oh, oh my God! I probably wasn't supposed to be talking about that. Uh, anyway. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway, he met somebody through the stream and they got married. So congratulations. So. Uh, oh well. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just wrap that. <laughs> I need two more Moving knuckleheads. <laughs> complete quest in Bryn Shander. Okay. You get knuckleheads by just killing uh, bears and wolves out in the. Uh, okay. The, uh, um, will you lead the way? Let's see. South. How can you not claim that experience reward? Oh, I'm saving it God, for Double man. Astral Diamonds weekend. That's when I claim them. Oh, oh Cause, you, for that role? Yeah, because every now and then you get Ugh. Double Astral Diamonds, and then might as well save it. I don't need it. Yeah, I've, I've noticed playing. that every time I've seen Paul do a Twitch <laughs> stream. <laughs> he has so many things up on the top of his screen to claim, and it drives me <laughs> nutty because I cannot oh, yeah, let sorry. those sit on mine. <laughs> yeah, I, I like getting the PowerPoint and throwing that in. Yeah, that's fun. <laughs> That's why I can never save up influence uh, claims up there. I just can't do it because I have to claim anything that's sitting up there. All right. Okay, there's a bear out here. Uh, that's south? Like the gate. There's okay, a I'm bear coming. Right over yeah, there. sorry. I had to watch yes, the south. channel. Come right out the main gate. Yeah, can... yeah this map's going to take a little while to. Uh... Yeah, oh, congratulations, Royal Bob. You're one of the, our, uh... Uh, you know, our favorite longtime viewers, and uh, we're really glad that things are going well for you. All right, I'm out here, and what are we doing? Just fighting? Heroic encounter? Uh, yeah, we got No, just I'm find some okay. animals. Did you guys notice this uh, enemy climbing up the wall here who froze into a ice statue? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Right up on the main wall there. It's just got one arm up on the, uh, over the top. Excellent. Yeah, so just uh, basically ride around, find some... Uh, when you come down around here, there's a bear rider over here, I assume he'll I just got two knuckleheads, head. so yeah, now confront the yeti, hunting the yeti, and I don't know what else. Oh, you get to hunt the yeti. Yeah, you have to go up back up to the ramparts there. You fight her, then she runs, you go out, you have to track her down, fight her again, and then the third time, I believe, you get to finish her off once you track her down. Right, well, we've got time. about five minutes left in the actual stream, so is there time to do that? Um, probably not. I, I didn't realize that quest was going to be active. It's weird watching the stream because, like, I'm hearing you and I know it's <laughs> ahead of time, so, like, it's it's behind. It's so fine to see how far Yeah, that's how it. Twitch works, unfortunately. If we used a different streaming service, like Beam, for instance, Beam has very little lag, like three seconds of lag. It's a lot faster and better in that regard. But, I mean, we've built up this great Twitch audience and we are going to stick with Twitch for the foreseeable future. I mean, you could you could start the stream if you want yeah, fighting let's her go, and uh, let's go look. Know, give people something to so look where do forward we go to. to, get to but, it? Uh, yeah, I I don't have the okay, trail for it. I think we it, go up um, here. Yeah. You know. And the siege is at the top. Oh, let's yeah, up let's where, go up top. Where, up where we just fought the Yetis, that's where you go again. So right up the stairs, wherever those are. Ah, crap! Hey, Fell zero. The stairs. Can I get an invite? Yeah, I, I did that. I found walking. Zero, up come on, man! <laughs> invite him. You're the group leader. I, I tried to invite him and I couldn't. Where is he? Um, Through the guild. I'm gonna start a contest soon. The Zara, you have to Paul, find him in the guild. Paul needs to open lockbox. Oh yeah, soon you're right. Because he's 35. All right, well let's finish this ghost. Oh, so. ghost of Ben Shandar. Kill that ghost. That'll give you another nice. thing to turn into the. Yeah. Ooh. I ran into. Yeah. Him today uh, is any one of you guys carrying around about 10 of those lockboxes? Yeah. <laughs> I just want you fall down. Uh, yes, <laughs> the new ones. Yeah, yeah I'm not good at steps. What can I say? Yeah. It's just like real life. <laughs> you should see, try to see me try to get in and out of my apartment. <laughs> well, you need some of those new ones. Paul? Uh, yeah, I don't. On, I don't have right enough there. to use all my keys. I have some. If I was there, I'd give them <sighs> to you. <laughs> you want the new ones, right? Yes. So just yeah, trade them over. Okay. Okay. Did you invite him now? Uh, I honestly just don't make me the group leader then. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I would do that easily. Okay. I mean, you invite somebody to the group the same way you. I would just. You know. Ah, there it is. Okay. Uh, oh, I'm the leader? Okay. 
Yeah, let's get Desire back in the group just so he can be on camera with us. That's how we prefer it. Okay, so you just gave me some <laughs> lock boxes. I believe I have enough lock boxes to use all my keys. So where are those boxes? They're my inventory's all screwed up since I picked up a lot of stuff and I haven't got to sort it lately. Here's the f running the last contest Thank now. Thank you, Icky. Um, you only have like twelve balls. Twelve what? The new okay, lock box. I have 12, and how many keys do I have? Uh, 12 keys, perfect. 12. See? Alright, yes. here we go. We're going to open the new lockbox and just see what we get. That's a fun thing. This is a premium item you find. I mean, no, no, the boxes, you find them all over the place, but to open them, you need <coughs> premium keys that you get from being a VIP member or just from buying keys with money from the Zen store. So here we go. First box, inscribed enchantment pack. Enchantments are always nice. Another inscribed enchantment pack. Another. <laughs> Astorian <laughs> relic pack, so that's something. Something different, anyway. Another inscribed enchantment pack. And another. There's a lot of variety to this <laughs> lockbox, isn't it? Yep, there's another Astorian relic. <laughs> Regal Stronghold Pack. This is nice. If, you, if you're if you in a guild, then the Regal Stronghold Pack gives you really nice things to donate to your guild stronghold, and that is helpful to the whole guild. Because you always need all these different materials to perform upgrades. Icebound Artifact Weapon Pack. Another one of those. Aurel's Companion Pack. Oh, that's going to give me some companion upgrade tokens. Yeah, do not open that. Wait until double yep. uh, enchantment. Double event. enchantments is next, nice. next week. Yeah. Actually, so. And Astorian yeah. Relic Pack. So, can I open some of these other things though? Which ones can I open? Oh, the Astorian Relics. That's cool because those are things you can trade in for fun. Yeah. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Yeah. You may you may get a, a higher level one where you can get up to you know 250, oh, 500 bond and blood. Oh, you get the uh, Zen purchase troll. Well, let's see what we can get. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. the, oh, the little, the little trial. Right on, Captain Johnny Walker. Yeah. yeah, that would be great. I got two Astorian Relics and one Excavator's Potion of Everfrost Resist out of the first one. That's nothing special. Next. Hey, I got a purple Astorian Relic. A relic exchangeable for 500 nice. Von and Blood. Yes. Yeah, buddy. And, uh, and a blue one for 250 Von and Blood and a green one. So that was a really mm -hmm. good one to open. And finally, this one is just yeah. two green ones. So that was pretty cool. And uh, what else did we get? Let's see, you said not to open. What about the inscribed enchantment pack? Do I wait on that? Uh, it's okay, those are okay. All right, if you're sure. Uh, as long uh, as there's no hey, enchantment. Hey, I got a lightning, well, I got a <laughs> lightning enchantment. Wouldn't that have, Ooh, that nice. did you think? That's, that's a weapon it's, enchantment, it's different. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, those does oh, okay. not double. All right, Dark Enchantment rank 7, Azure Enchantment rank 7. These are still things that would not be doubled. Okay. No. Nope. Superior Mark of Potency, 2 rank 7 Azures. Greater Mark of Potency, Dark and Silvery Enchantment. And this one, same thing actually. So, no, Dark and Azure. All right. Well, those are fun to open. Basic lightning enchantment selling for sixty thousand. Really, not too shabby. I need to put that on the trade house. Yeah, Let's buddy. see how that looks. Tarmily trade house. Mike and Simons. Now, if I can only find it in my inventory, that's the hard part. Well, it's all messed up. <laughs> yeah, there's one for just uh, over fifty nine thousand. Then from there on, it's sixty, sixty one, sixty two, sixty six. It just goes. Yeah, okay, I don't so. need my old Vorpal enchantment anymore, do I? Okay, yeah, I'm going to put the buyout price it's at It's either you sell it or you pass it to your all. 55999 do you think that'll sell? Uh, right. Probably. It's the cheapest uh, one right. listed. Good enough <laughs> for me. I'm not greedy. 14% weapon damage is lightning damage with every strike. It can chain up to one time at a 50% chance. Who chains. gave me this Warple enchantment? All cool, all cooldowns are reduced uh, by 2%. Was he Jay? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah, do you Is think he'll get mad if I sell it? Probably not, right? Well, there's uh, not any witnesses. <laughs> yeah. Wait. <Please>. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's not here. 
Uh, hey, if no one killed the ghost of Bren Shandor, he's back. He's oh. coming at us right now. Watch out. He's okay, let's, you yeah, let's just... Massive area of everybody hit attack. him. He won't attack you until you so attack I'll, him. So I'll like, consider yeah. selling that Vorpal enchantment later. So let's just kill this guy, and, uh, and we should wrap things up. He should drop something for anyone who didn't attack yeah. him before. So I hope... Okay, yeah? so... What? Uh, we still have four codes of um, Call of Duty beta. Anyone yeah, wants just them? Should type it out publicly. If anybody wants a Call of Duty Infinite Warfare Xbox One beta code, remember the beta is only good for this weekend, although they might extend it by a day, maybe. But it is only good basically for tomorrow. But if you want a code, you want to try out Infinite Warfare's multiplayer, then just speak up in chat and you can have one because we got a few extras. And uh, from what I played of Infinite Warfare multiplayer, it is really fast and fun, and I like the sci-fi space environments and stuff. So I, I highly recommend everybody give it a try. Don't sell Vorpal right now, Shawnee Peak says. Interesting. Yeah, why not, Shawnee Peak? Any particular reason? You know somebody who needs it? Double refinement probably would be What's the higher. Scoop? You could sell it oh, higher. Oh, during double refinement, sell it then. Nice. Lord Phoenix yeah. would like an Infinite Ooh, Warfare code. Oh, and so would Court. Yeah, okay, there you go, Icky. You got some people speaking up about it. Yeah. All right, so that okay. sounds good. Um, so, guys, okay. this has been Neverwinter Storm King's Thunder, the latest expansion for Neverwinter for Xbox One and PlayStation 4. It's already also out on PC. They're one expansion ahead of us, but we'll get that in a month or two, a couple months, I think. Yes, Royal Bob, that still works. Uh, I hope every, you know, if you haven't tried Neverwinter yet, I highly recommend you try it. And make sure you actually give multiplayer a shot. Like, you can play a lot of this stuff all by yourself, but you'll have the most fun playing with a group, especially joining a guild. And remember, Windows Central Guild is always looking for more active players on Xbox. So if you're an active Xbox player and you need a guild, send a message to me on Xbox Live. East X is my gamer tag. East X. Very easy to send me a message, and we will be happy to get you into the guild. We have 20 open spots cool, right yeah, now. and and we'll drop a few people who don't play anymore. You know, you'll, periodically you have to do that. But yeah, Andar, you've been great at recruiting. We really appreciate that. <laughs> active players, folks. We do like active players. Absolutely. Yeah, and uh, and we want people who know how to chat. You know, Neverwinter supports keyboard chat on Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Very important that you learn how to chat, answer, you know, watch people chat, reply to them, etc. And voice chat is obviously very good for teaming up, like what we're doing now, but a lot of times it needs to be keyboard chat, or you can use your controller, but it's a lot slower. Yeah. Uh, so, what else were we going to say? That was the Windows Central Guild, right, right. Everybody knows to read tonight's article, please leave a comment. Don't forget to read our WWE 2K17 review running tomorrow at windowscentral.com. Really would appreciate those views and comments, guys. Next weekend, what are we streaming next weekend? We are hoping to stream maybe Farming Simulator 17 multiplayer. We might do that. But also, if we get a more exciting game to stream, then we will. But I think Farming Simulator is actually a pretty neat game. And a lot of you guys probably have never played one. So, you know, tuning in and watching us stream it is a good way to see what the heck it's like. Why do people like Farming Simulator? What's so fun about farming? The only way to find out is to watch somebody play, and it might as well be somebody who's your bestest friend, which is me. <laughs> Love you guys. Love you all. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> yes, oh, uh, but I also want to thank everybody on mic before we sign out. So thank you, Zero. All good. Pleasure Excellent. to be here. Mon Petit, it was nice having you here being quiet. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, you're a quiet person, we know. Thank you for having me, yes. though. So glad you joined our guild. It took a little while, but we convinced you eventually, didn't we? We did. Yes, y'all did. Andar did. Good job, Andar. Thank you, Andar <laughs> and Azara. Thank you, Andar. Yeah, her husband had absolutely nothing to do with it. <laughs> yeah, no, my husband has nothing to do with hey, anything. Hey. Hey, well, I mean, it's better to be spending time together in the same place, in the same guild, than to be apart. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, and finally, thank you, Icky, for running tonight's contest and for generally being an awesome part of the stream and our guild. Oh, well, come. Yeah, thanks, Icky. Excellent. So, yeah, Icky, Icky is awesome. Oh, and there's Panjaman from the guild saying hi in Twitch chat. Excellent. Oh, Excellent. Hey, Al. 
Oldest member yes. of the guild right He's there. He's in his 70s, an amazing, amazing member of our guild, also a very regular player, and he never spends any money. He plays completely free. He's got multiple level 70 characters and hasn't spent a dime on this game, so... Don't get sucked into the... You have, ah, oh, oh right. let's kill this Yeti. Yeti. Yeah, the answer... <laughs> somebody asked how you get your prize if you won, and the answer is you check your Twitch PMs, and you may have to go to the spam or other folder of your Twitch PMs. So just remember to... Uh, hey, where'd he go? Retreat. It's uh, it's part... He must be there for that it. quest where you... Oh, that's the yeah. quest that you have with the Yeti. Now you have to track her down. So that's actually the last over the wall? quest you had there. Is that where... Uh, you might be able to do that. Ooh, I have not yeah. tried that. It it's looks faster. like it might hurt yes, a little. You but can. Yeah. You can. You can. All right, it. so that worked. <laughs> oh, you, yeah. to you totally can. Awesome. Much faster than walking <laughs> down those stairs. You know how much trouble they give me. No, I was going to fall really anyway, faster. so... I'm, I'm always <laughs> going to do that now. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> all right, well, it's nice meeting you all. Please come back next time or whenever you can, and we'll be happy to see you again and get to know you better. Right. Uh, oh yeah, follow me on Twitter if you don't mind. Twitter.com slash Paul R. Acevedo. Icky, will you type the Twitter command to share it on the stream? Exclamation uh, Twitter. Oh, oh, or yeah, oh I'm, sorry, anybody who's I'm, not busy. I'm, um, I'm yeah, sending no, mess. I, I forgot yeah, all about that. I'm not used to you having to run double duty. There you go, yeah. Alright, see you next time guys. Whatever you do, don't hate. Appreciate. You know, I really... I... Take care. Yeah. Later. You know who I miss? I miss Tyler. Even though he's an SOB. <laughs> okay, we're all...